This video is part of the Algo Traders Toolkit series, wherein I share with you various practical and useful tools that you would need to have in your toolkit in case you want to become an efficient Algo Trader. I'm going to be talking about one of my favorite tools, the Chartlink Scanner. If you are an Algo Trader and you're not currently using this powerful tool, then you may be missing out on all the fun. In this video, I'm going to be introducing you to a small Python utility that can automatically scrape and extract charting results into a data frame. I'm going to demonstrate a practical example of how I use this utility in one of my own trading strategies. And finally, talk about how charting can be of immense help to you in speeding up the process of building and deploying strategies. I'll be sharing the link to our community website, fabtrader.in, and you can download this Python utility for free from this location. So let's get started. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Vivek, and I'm a financially independent algo trader. This channel is all about building a community of algo traders. We discuss everything about algo trading using Python, building and practicing trading strategies, market updates, and much more. Please do visit our community website, fabtrader.in. Also do check out my other YouTube channel, FabWealth, where I talk about my own financial independence journey and share tools, methods, and strategies that help me achieve my financial freedom. Thank you. Chatting screener doesn't need a lot of introduction. The fact that you have clicked on this link tells me that you're already aware of what charting is and how it works. So we're not going to spend a lot of time trying to explain how this tool works. And we, we will directly jump into the Python utility and see how that works. At the outset, a charting screener, you typically design or input your screen. And then when you run scan, you get the results here. The Python utility in question is going to directly scrape this particular screen and then download the output from this screen into a data frame. And this is the Python utility that I'm talking about. You would need to install these dependencies, which are requests, pandas, and beautiful soup four. And the utility takes two primarily two inputs. One is the, the URL of the, the screen, which is, which is this typically. And then the number two is the scan clause. To find out the scan clause for your respective screens, all you need to do is just right click on your web page, go into inspect, and go into network and then try running scan, you would see a process, one of these processes comes up and then click on it and then go into payload. And the scan clause is right at the top. So all you need to do is just copy this part and then input that as part of your input into the function here. So as I said, it takes two inputs. One is the, the URL that we looked at and then the scan clause. And then once you provide this and then run, you would get the exact same results as you see on the scanner itself. And this is in a data frame. So now you can go ahead and use this directly in your algo and then apply various strategy rules on top of it. So this is how simple it is. This utility is available for free for download. And this is available in our community website, which is fabrader.in. And then I'll provide the link in the description. Now that you know how the utility works, let me just give you an example of how I use it for my strategies. In fact, I use charting screener for multiple strategies of mine. Here's one example of how I do it. This particular strategy is called Tridevi. Uh, the, the logic of the strategy is pretty simple. You have the 5, 20, 50, 100, and 200 SMAs. So whenever these SMAs come together into a very tight uh, range, uh, range often within 3% of the, the current closing price, the chances of it breaking out is pretty high. right? So you typically look for these tight ranges and scan for those stocks and then wait for the breakout and then trade on those. That's the overall idea about it. For example, in the scan that we just ran, HDFC came up as one of those eligible stocks. So you see there is a, a tightening of all the SMAs happening here. The SMAs are all squeezed up in a very tight spot within the 3% uh, range of the, the last closing price. And then whenever this happens, for example, in the previous time this happened, you see this huge breakout rally happening. And this is what we are actually looking for. And this is my Algo dashboard that I built as part of my Algo trading platform. And Tridevi, I've been running this on one of my smaller accounts. And uh, the brown part is the, the equity curve of the strategy. And the white part is the Nifty 50. So you see the, the equity curve looks pretty good. The drawdown, the underwater plot is also like less than 3%. This is actually 0% because this particular strategy does not have a stop loss. I'd uh, made a couple of mistakes due to which I had to close two of the trades because of which you see this. Otherwise, you don't close any trades. You just keep it open until your targets are hit. And even if you look at the benchmark versus strategy 
Um, there's almost a three multiplier difference. It, the, the strategy beats the benchmark. So it's a very simple strategy and yet at, a, at the same time, very effective. The reason why I love this particular utility and charting specifically is that this particular logic, if I had to build it within my Python algo, it's going to take a, quite a bit of coding. Uh, I won't say it's very complex, but at the same time, you know, it's not simple either. So it's going to uh, require some serious amount of coding to get this logic uh, built. But in this case, since charting does most of the work, all I have to do is just download the, the results, pick up the top one, and then apply it to my strategies and, and make buy or sell decisions based on that. So that's how simple and effective charting can be uh, if you combine charting and the, the Python utility that I just talked about. So the successful combination of charting and the Python utility that I just talked about can drastically cut down the time it would take for you to automate your strategies. If you found some value in this video, please consider subscribing and liking the video. And I will see you soon in another video. Until then, take care. Bye.